So Richard, tell me about your plans for the second half of 2022. One of our key objectives is the full deployment of our VMobile 360 WorkX Cloud that integrates with the forklift safety system. Right. So actually we've been working on this for, I think, close to a year now. And we've done some deployments of cloud with customers in China. And now we're pretty close to being able to launch it worldwide. So I think one of the key benefits of the cloud is that it enables managers to understand the behavior of their drivers a lot more easily and a lot more clearly. For example, you can see the number of fatigue alerts or smartphone usage alerts. You can also see, for example, how many potential pedestrian detection incidents happen in a day. Ah, so if the driver is actually a safe driver or, right, right. or maybe there's a problem area in yes. the warehouse where yes. uh, he's running into traffic all the time. Yes, so suddenly you've got a whole new set of statistics that you can start to look at. Right. and analyze and get a much, much clearer picture of what exactly is happening on the warehouse floor or the factory floor. So I think another key benefit of the cloud is that it enables new features like vehicle inspections. So for example, one feature we've put into the system is that when the driver starts their shift, the system will prompt them to carry out an inspection before they can actually drive the vehicle. Oh, right, because uh, usually in uh, warehouses, you'd have a driver with a clipboard and they'd have yeah. to do a walk yeah. around exactly. and check the boxes, right? So what we're trying to do is to reduce the amount of paperwork that is involved in managing these kind of vehicles. Well, that sounds like it would speed up the, the process yes. if you're removing paperwork. Exactly, and also obviously the retrieval of that information later on, should there be an incident or should there be an audit or something like that, becomes a lot easier because it's instantly dis digitized. Right, it's sent to the cloud, stored there yeah. so that if there's a problem even the, the same day, the yeah. manager can take a look yes. back and see if the inspection was done properly. And exactly. So we've had a lot of good initial response from customers about this and we've been working with them to fine tune the features. I'm hoping in July and August we'll be ready to go mainstream with this solution. Right. Um, how about the uh, new market trends? I think what we're seeing and what we saw at Logimat and then also at Modex, another show we've been to is that, um, as we mentioned earlier, EVs are big and we're seeing a rapid transition across to EV forklifts because they're more environmentally friendly. They're also a lower total cost of ownership over a long period of time. So I think that's a key trend that we're seeing. And that's one of the reasons why we introduced the DC to DC converter. Right now, because of the economic situation, there's a lot of different issues that um, companies are dealing with. A lot of different factors. A lot of different factors. One thing is that you're still seeing labor shortages. One thing we see with the cloud in the future is something like, how can you leverage the cloud to improve driver training? You know, it takes time to get people up, up on board and, um, and driving the vehicles. And then how do you continue the training once they've joined you? So I think that's one potential application we see in the future. So labor shortage is an issue. Obviously, we're still continuing to see supply chain disruptions. And so I think what it's leading a lot of customers to do is to look at their operations and see, well, how can we make them more flexible? How can we make them more efficient? But at the same time, how do we make them safer? So basically more um, automate the process yes. and yes. also increase safety yes. for your workers who yes. are there. Exactly. So, right. And this is where I think um, we're hitting a nice sweet spot with the system. And I think particularly with the cloud attachment in the future.